Hello Stepper! Welcome to Frenchie's video. I'm Franz Martin, independent demonstrator with Stamping Up, and today it's two quick tips for uh, the mask on back to keep it that it stay up. See this one stay up, and also how uh, to do a floating uh, snowflake. So I just got that from the colorful season, the uh, framelits. What I done, it's take that fine uh, thread, This I use the silver one, just use a little piece, I mean a little, um, not too long, sorry my hand are all inking, today it's video after video, and you're going to see I get a lovely mess here when I remove something. Um, you're going to pass it in the front, and keep those loop right here and bring uh, the other two piece here bring that in like so bring it to the back here so then and the reason why i pull to the back it's make sure to not um, grab this is so shake it and remove it and see you don't really see this that's why i call that a floating snowflake and then i'm going to take those two um piece the thread just do a little um, and do it as long as you want oops this one is not coming through okay pull that together that's about right that link and then cut this I had plenty I rather work with more than less and then you get your little um, loop I'm gonna first let's tie this a knot well the knot just a single knot whatever like this so it's gonna stay up nicely now I'm gonna take my uh, snowflake pass it in this and when it's hang up really you don't see that linen thread it's almost like fish, fishing a line and then do your little bow so you get your floating um, snowflake let's put that I get a little mess here for some reason here we go okay put my little bow shorter and voila so now I got my little floating snowflake so and I'm gonna have the supplies for this it's very simple but you see how straight it sticks well, if you just put your, that when it's nugget, if you just put your uh, candy in it, a lot of time it won't roll, okay? So I use a piece of cardstock, and I'm using crumb cake because it don't show. If you use a darker one, it can't show in the back. So uh, this measure one inch wide by four. And what i done, it's go about the center there. Just do little peek here no need to measure just go from the center cut and cut so now you get this shape you're going to take this slide it in so now you understand why i did those two peak to go at the corner if not it wanted to bulk so now i just push that down put my peak at the corner oops in the center and over here make sure it's flat and then I'm gonna fill my candy if I don't eat them all right et voila maybe they're gonna have a little piece of uh, crumb cake paper a little piece of uh, metallic thread in that and then close it and tie it up and see it stay straight so that's how I done my uh, bag to stay straight and the floating um, snowflake hope this helped you with your lovely muslin bag all well it's called Santa bag all the what I use and more uh, detail on how to stamp on it I'm gonna add the link at the end I got another video for that but um, all the detail the supplies list will be on my blog below in the description or above in the eye thank you so much and have a lovely day bye bye for now